the farm school, children learn while running, screaming, and having fun. Can you find your favorite pumpkin and bring it over to the grass? Allison Huff, who's taught at other schools, says kids here learn through a more hands-on style. When we were doing the pumpkins, we incorporated the counting, we incorporated opposites. They were explaining um, the colors, just the sizes. I mean, we can use everything that a regular preschool uses, but out in the garden. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro. Farm preschoolers also have a chance to learn foreign languages. What do you think we're going to make with that milk? That good, butter. They learn where milk comes from and how to make butter out of it. That's because farm animals are part of the curriculum. The idea for a school like this grew organically after Jacqueline and Kenny Jenkins bought this five-hectare farm with a late 18th century house. They called it One Day Farm. We named it One Day Farm because we always said one day that would be our goal and that would be our dream. Then all of a sudden, all of these friends and families started to come out. They said they wanted to to see what farming was like. And we had all these animals. They wanted to come see our animals, wanted to ride the pony, wanted to pet the goats and collect eggs. And uh, that's when it started to spark of a farm school. You can pet her. Say hi, Lucy. The Jenkins see a need for this kind of open space, hands-on learning. Watching where our society is today with um, most kids glued to their iPads or their iPhones, and they learn that way, and they don't they don't learn with their hands anymore. The number one question immediately we get from parents is what happens when it rains? And uh, we say bring an extra pair of clothes. That attitude helped Courtney Williams decide to enroll her three-year-old in the school. He is learning to count his colors, all the things to keep him you know, competitive in this education competition. But he gets to be a kid. He gets to jump in puddles and he gets to try to climb trees and run and roll down hills. Not only does he bring what he's learning home, but he he brings actual vegetables home, he brings home eggs, and um, it has pushed me out of the box on what I've learned to cook and try, and he's willing to try all of it because he grew it. All righty, friends, let's go feed the chickens. That's the influence the farm school wants to have, teaching the whole family and bringing the great outdoors back into the classroom. For writer Faisal Masri, I'm Faith Lapidus, VOA News.